So what's going on guys, it is JM, it is Beatboxing. Make sure you guys subscribe to this channel before you click on to any of the videos. Also comment below in the comment section if you guys have any opinions on what I'm saying in any of the videos. Like always, it's appreciated if you guys could drop me a quick sober tour on my channel. So Callum Smith has joined the World Boxing Super Series. So this means Callum Smith will not be fighting for the WBC Super Middleweight title on September the 9th against Anthony Durrell. Anthony Durrell has declined entering this tournament and there was a bit of a debacle over Callum Smith's title fight with Durrell because Durrell wanted the fight moved to Flint, Michigan, his hometown on September the 8th but Callum Smith and Eddie Hearn were like, no mate, we signed for this fight on September the 9th in LA on the undercard of Abdomares and Leo Santa Cruz, their rematch. So now Callum Smith has said fuck this and joined the World Boxing Super Series and whoever he draws in the first round of the tournament he will fight them for the WBC Diamond title which is kind of an interim title I guess but so far there are a few decent names in the super middleweight division in this tournament you've got George Groves WBA champion Callum Smith really wants to fight with George Groves and he really hopes he gets it hopefully in the final if both fighters make it that far and you also got other domestic rival Jamie Cox undefeated fighter and you've got Swedish fighter Eric Skoglund undefeated as well and you've got former light heavyweight champion Jürgen Bremer which is a bit of a shock moving down to super middleweight for the first time in 10 years at 38 years old whatever and there are a few more names adding to the tournament as well by July 8th guess we'll find out then who that is but I'm going to quote Callum Smith here he says I'm thrilled to participate in the World Boxing Super Series what an honour it will be to fight for the WBC Diamond title in the quarter final but there is so much more at stake than just one belt the Muhammad Ali trophy as well as a potential domestic showdown for George Groves in the final this tournament is very exciting for boxing and I'm thrilled to be part of it I look forward to travelling to Monaco for the draft gala on Saturday and find out who my opponent will be and I'm also going to quote Eddie Earn here, his promoter, he's talking about the Anthony Durrell situation. He goes, it's been a very frustrating period for Callum, but now we have clarity and something he can really get his teeth into. He is a technically excellent fighter with huge power, who we believe has all the attributes to become a world champion and stay there. So, yeah, the Super 16 Super Series, World Boxing Super Series, is looking like it's going to be very good for both the super middleweight and cruiserweight divisions the cruiserweight division especially because i think all the world champions in the cruiserweight division have entered this tournament which is banging in my opinion which is absolutely banging but yeah the first round will take place in september and october and then there'll be two semi-finals in early 2018 and the final should be in may 2018 so this tournament will come around quick so yeah, I look forward to it. Callum Smith, another interesting name, but he won't be fighting for his world title on September the 9th. So, it is what it is. Comment below your opinion on this. Do you think this is good for Callum Smith? It's JMHP Box.